that sea. Oh my freaking goodness. I can't be bugs. What is up, Aphrodites? Yes, we are finally, finally, finally doing an nail tutorial. Yes, it's finally here. It's finally happening. Today, we're going to be doing a nail design that I like to call the cut crease. We're not going to be doing the design on my nails because they be looking ratchet right now. So we're going to use my sister's beautiful paintless nails today. For this design, you're going to need tape, clear nail polish, you can use white nail polish of your choice, and you can use any kind of color that you want for the cut crease. My sister wanted pink for her nails. So for the first step in creating this nail design, you're going to want to put on your clear coat just to protect the natural nails so they don't stain. Once that top coat dries, you're going to want to add the white polish next. And if you get a little polish on the skin, don't worry, you can scrape it off. Let those dry for a few minutes and we'll come back and put on the tape. So when that dries, you're going to want to put your tape in a V shape. So that when you peel it off, that polish that you put on is all that shows. Now for this step, you can choose any kind of color or any kind of design that you want to do. Um, my sister kind of wanted like a polka dotted pink look, so that's what I did here. Once you let your design dry for a couple of minutes, you want to slowly peel it off. It's okay if you peel off some of the white polish. Um, we had to uh, kind of rush here because I was losing lighting and I needed that natural lighting. So we were kind of rushing, which is why some of it is peeling off. But if you happen to just peel it off by accident, you can always go back and paint over it. Also, painting over it, if you mess up, will also um, sometimes help to shape your crease better and maybe define it and make it more sharp. After you've peeled off your tape, you're going to want to add a top coat so that your design lasts longer. And it looks shiny and pretty. Alright, that is the end of this tutorial. I hope you like this video. I hope you decide to do this design. It's very eye-catching and it's fairly easy to do. Um, I hope you like it and I hope you decide to try it out. And I'll see you next week! Thank you for watching that little show